Yo, what's going on everybody? New video, lots of new updates to the TradingView AI. Let's check it out. You can now upload images straight to Horizon AI. Go to the top, copy the image, paste it into the chat. You can ask whatever you like, send it straight off for analysis. The script builder is loaded with way more blocks and options, meaning you can build more than before. Plus I've added a new feature where you could load preset projects. Easily get started by just selecting one of these projects and you could compile to get the script straight away. I've made the AI much smarter, Plus I've given more access to free users, so free users can now use the Horizon AI chat for a limited time. Plus they get more compiles each day, so you could use the script builder and compile scripts for five times a day. Alright, before we get started and do a deep dive into all these updates, I do want to just say Horizon AI is completely free to sign up and use. Just check the description, head to the website link. Just visit our website, it's free to sign up, no credit card needed. Free users get limited use of the Horizon AI chat, plus the script builder. If you were to sign up for paid, you get unlimited blocks and unlimited compiles in the script builder, plus unlimited chat, and then you get the image analysis as well for the paid. Alright, let's jump into it and get started with the Horizon AI chat. So once again, yeah, the free users can now use this chat. If you don't know what the chat is, basically I've fine-tuned my own AI to be much better at trading views code. So Horizon AI is better than ChatGPT and all that because this AI has been fine-tuned on PineScript. So just for an example, you could see all the preset options here. If you try any of these preset options with ChatGPT, you're definitely not going to get the right code. But these are just some ideas to get started with Horizon AI. So another really cool thing with the chat is that it plugs directly into TradingView. So you can see this window here is like right in TradingView. If I move this here, if I close this, you see this button here, which is the Horizon AI button. Open that up and you get the Horizon AI chat. What's even cooler is that it connects straight into the Pine Editor. So you can see at the bottom down here, it says not connected to the Pine Editor. Open it up to connect. What we do is just come over to the bottom left corner down here, open up the Pine Editor, and then this will automatically connect like you've just seen. To all the code that is currently inside your script right here. So for example, at the moment I'm working on an EMA crossover script down here, you can see. And I have no chat history with Horizon AI. But what I want to do, all I'm going to do is just say, can you change the fast EMA blue color to purple? Or I'm going to say. So I'm going to ask it to change the blue color to purple. It's going to automatically know that I'm talking about the EMA crossover script because we're connected to the Pine Editor. I don't need to reference anything else or even upload the script. So if I just click send for this, see there you go. So it automatically knows that we're talking about the script in here. It knows this line here, we've changed it from color blue to color purple. But if you find a script on TradingView that you want to change, just like add some alerts to, copy the script code, paste it inside the Pine Editor, just like I've done here, open up Horizon AI, and you just talk to it to change. So you could just say, for yeah, for example, add alerts to this indicator, and it'll automatically know that you're talking to this. Another update is Horizon AI is much better at fixing errors now. So just like before, if you ever get an error, Horizon AI can detect the error, but now it's much better at fixing the error. So for example, if I break this script, I'm gonna just remove this parenthesis and then add it to chart. You're gonna see we're gonna get an error here. Then you can see at the bottom down here, the updates with the Horizon AI. The AI can detect that there's an error as well. When you click fix now, it, the AI is much better at understanding the problems and fixing them. This is an easy example, but if I click fix, it'll send it off to Horizon AI for fixing. You can see it sends back the whole code plus the fix right here. So I copied that, pasted over everything inside here add it to my chart, error disappears down here, plus it's able to be added to my chart because there's no errors now. If you're a premium subscriber, you can now upload images to Horizon AI. The easiest way to do this is to go to Trading View. At the top right corner, there's a nice little uh, screenshot button. If you click that, you can go copy image. That's going to copy uh, the chart image here. And then all you need to do is go down to the AI chat, I click and paste. You can, of course, if you've got an image saved on your computer, you can click this button here to upload an image just like you normally would. When the image is attached, you can type anything you like. You can also read the indicators that is attached to your chart. So I've got this EMA crossover indicator attached to my chart. I could ask, I'm going to say the EMA crossover signal is bearish. What do you think? If I send that off, the AI will think about it and send back its source. So you can see that it's... Yeah, analyze the chart. You can see that even what indicators we're using and the, the code, which is correct, it's the 9 and the 21. You can see down here, it's reading our code as well. Gives it all its thoughts. It even at the end added a suggestion, adding volume confirmation, and then gave us the code for that as well. Cool. Thank you, AI. All right, so that's like most of the new updates with the Horizon AI chat. Let's jump over to the script builder and check this out. 
So I'm gonna open it up at the moment. Straight away, there's lots of new blocks on the left side over here. Plus you can see there's a new load project function right at the top. The new load project option allows you guys to easily just load in preset scripts into the script builder. So if you're new to the script builder and don't know how it works, you could easily just jump into this, click some of these, and you get to see how they, how they connect and how they work. You could also jump in and modify them yourself. So say if I want to open up the market structure and order blocks one, click on it, it's gonna load it up. If I wanted to change any of this, you could open up some of these uh, settings for the two indicators. Let's open up the market structure one. You get to change the settings just like this and you get to change the time frame as well. So maybe we want to make this a higher time frame, or maybe change the left and right bars. You could do the same with the order blocks, open up the settings, change the sensitivity, change how they're mitigated, change the time frame. You can even change um, you know, how much you're buying, what the buying settings are, add a trailing stop. If you're new to the script builder, it's a, it's a much easier way to get jump right in and get started. You don't have to build this from scratch and it gives you an idea of what's possible. You can see the New York uh, open midnight line, for example, if we load that up, you can see how that's done up. We use the day and time node. If you click this up, we get a New York time every day right at midnight. And then we just draw the line. We just draw one line, straight vertical line. We draw another line out from the open. And then we also add a label as well that says New York Midnight Open. If you compile this, you can compile any single one of these scripts and just get started straight away. If you ever get unsure how to build anything or how, how certain blocks work or how to connect anything, make sure you check out the guide. The guide details each one of the explanations of how to use any, any one of these blocks, plus how to connect stuff and just how to generally use the script builder. All right, so that's about it for this video. I just wanted to keep it short and sweet. If you like what you see, make sure you download it, give this all a try for yourself. Check all the links in the description. I've got the guide, the link to my free Discord, plus the website. If you like this video, please leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you want to see more. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.